hi this is shubham from monish view and today in this podcast we will discuss best way of a pitch presentation for a startup funding over here we gonna discuss about the pitch desk presentation how it is made what are different components if you want to read the full article then the link of a article is provided in description so let's discuss what is the pitch presentation a pitch desk presentation is a short and brief presentation normally not more than 20 minutes to a investor explaining about the prospectus of a company and why they should invest into the startup business so pitch desk presentation is a brief presentation basically using powerpoint to provide a quick overview of a business plan and convincing the investor to put some money into the business pitch presentation can be made either during a face to face meeting or online meeting with an potential investor customer partners co-founders etc so let's discuss some of the important way which has to be there or flow of communication in this pitch presentation the first one is an introduction to start with first step is to give a brief account of yourself that is who are you what are you doing but care should be taken to make it is short and sweet also use this opportunity to get your investor interested in your company once you also talk up to the most interesting facts about the company business as well as any huge milestone that you have achieved the second important part is a team the next step is to introduce the audience to the people behind the scene the reason is that investor will want to know the people who are going to make a product or a service successful moreover the investor are not only a putting money towards the idea but they are also investing in the team also an attempt should be made to include the background of a promoter and how it is related to the new company moreover if possible it can also highlighted that the team has worked together in the past and achieve a significant reason third important thing is a problem further the promoter should be able to explain the problem he is going to solve and solution emerging from it further the investor should be convinced that the newly introduced product or a service will solve the problem convincingly for instance when a facebook was launched in 2004 it added some new features which give it more a professional and lively look in a comparison to orkut which was there for some time it enabled facebook to become an instant hit among the people further customer have no privacy while using the orkut however in a facebook you can view personal profile only if it adds you to the hit list these simple yet effective advantages give a facebook upper hand over the orkut the four key factor over here is a solution it is very important to describe in the pitch desk presentation as to how the company is planning to solve the problem for example when a flipkart first started a business in 2007 it brought the concept of a e-commerce in india but when they started payment through credit cards was rare so they introduced a system of a payment on the basis of cash on delivery which was later followed by other e-commerce business in india the second problem was the entire supply chain system delivering goods on a time is one of the most important factor that determine the success of an e-commerce company flipkart addressed this issue by launching their own supply chain management system to deliver order in a timely manner this innovative technique used by flipkart enable them to raise a large amount of capital from the investor the fifth important factor is a marketing and sales this is a very important and crucial part where the investors will be deeply interested the marketing size of a product must be communicated to the investor this can include profile of a target customer but one should be prepared to answer the question about how the promoter is planning to attract the customer if a business is already selling goods the promoter can also be brief the investor about the growth and forecast of a future revenue and here comes the sixth point based on the fifth point that is projection or milestone it is true that it is a difficult to make a financial projection for a startup concern it is an organization doesn't have a long financial history and educated guess can be a made projected financial statement can be prepared which gives an organization a brief idea about where is the business heading it tells us that the whether the business will making a profit or loss financial projection include three basic document that makes up a business financial statement the first is a income statement this project how much money the business will generate by projecting income and expenses such as sales cost of goods sold expenses and capital for your first year in business you will 
want to create a monthly income statement for second it may be a quarter can onwards you can make an annual statement but the income statement give a projection of a very important factor that is a sales side the second statement is a cash flow statement a projected cash flow statement will decide how much cash will be coming into the business and out of that cash how much cash will be utilized into the business at the end each period you can choose over here monthly quarterly annually one can tally it up to the how much it affects the profit and loss and what is real cash cycle of your business the third important aspect is a balance sheet the balance sheet shows the business overall financial including asset liability and equity typically one will create an annual balance sheet for one financial projection it is very important to provide a bigger picture for long duration of your startup the next stage in pitch presentation is a competition early business organization has a competition even if the product or service offered is a new or unique it is a necessary to highlight in the pitch presentation as to how the product or services are different from their competition if any of a competitor have been acquired their complete details like a name of organization acquisition price etc should be also highlighted the next important key factor in a pitch presentation is a business model the term business model is a wide term denoting core aspects of a business including business purpose process target customer what we are offering strategies infrastructure organizational structure sourcing of a fund trading strategies operational process policies and everything further as per the Investopedia the business model is the way in which a company generate revenue and make profit from a company operation analyst use the term gross profit as a way to compare the efficiency and effectiveness of a firm's business model gross profit is calculated by subtracting cost of goods sold from revenue a business model can be illustrated with the help of an example there are two companies company a and company b both companies are engaged in a business of a renting movies prior to the evident of a inherent both the companies rent movies physically both companies made 5 crores as a revenue cost of goods sold 4 crores so the company make 1000 crore as a gross profit after the introduction of internet company a started to offer movie online instead of renting or selling physically this change offered the business model of a company a positively revenue still is 5 crore but the significant part cost of goods sold is now 2 crore this is because online sale lead to a significant reduction in storage and distribution cost so the gross profit increase from 20% to 60% therefore company a isn't making a more sales but it's figure out way to re- revolutionize its business model managers at company a will have an additional 40% of margin to play with the management of a company a manager at a company a will have little room of error and that have treated carefully hence every investor want to get his money back so it's an important to tell them in a pitch presentation as to how they should plan to generate revenue in the model the next important factor is a financing if a startup business firm has raised money it is preferable to talk about how much money has already been raised who invested money into the business and what they did about it if no money has been raised till date then explanation can be made regarding how much work has been accomplished with the help of minimum funding that companies managed to raise it is a true that investor like to see entrepreneur who have invested in their own money if a promoter is a pitching to raise a capital he should list how much he is looking to raise and how much he intend to use the fund so here is guys what is a bottom line pitch presentation is a short direct communication of approx 20 minutes to an individual or a group of interested party to crack a future deal for a business it should be a brief but should cover every aspects of a economy as well as the business sector where the startup is moving to thank you guys for joining with us for this podcast if you want to read the full article then the link of article is in description thank you shubham from here monist view signing off